Hi there everybody, my name is Jim Seaback. I'm the brewmaster here at Revolution Brewing Company and I'm here today to chat with you about Dark Mode, one of the uh, imperial stouts that we brew here at Revolution Brewing Company in aged bourbon barrels. Uh, Dark Mode is a beer that is really showcasing some wonderful specialty malts from uh, Bree Malting Company in Chilton, Wisconsin. The dark malts especially give this beer a really rich, chocolatey, roasty complexity. Dark chocolate malt, roasted barley, and a deep bittered black malt called Black Prince. Also coupled with some uh, caramelized malts, uh, Caramel 120 malt, and also some, this is a little secret ingredient in this beer, is a little a bit of applewood smoke malt. Just a tiny, tiny bit, just to get, add to the complexity of the overall malt profile of this beer. We also sneak in a little bit of Simpson's Naked Golden Oats, which is a caramelized oat malt, which is huskless, so you don't get any bitterness from Simpson's malting in uh, England. The resulting beer is super silky and smooth. We're also adding a little bit of lactose milk sugar towards the end of our boil here. Lactose milk sugar is unfermentable by brewer's yeast, so it passes into the finished product and gives the beer a little bit of residual sweetness and some texture and mouthfeel. So if you're lactose intolerant, be uh, very wary about this beer for sure. The hopping of dark mode is very mellow. We're only targeting 30 IBUs in this finished product. Uh, we achieve that by using some Hercules and Centennial hops during our three hour boil to just give this beer enough bitterness to balance out the big malt complexity. The resulting beer is then fermented with our English ale yeast uh, 1968. That's our house ale yeast here. Uh, after fermentation, this beer goes into bourbon barrels and is aged for uh, a year plus. Once the beer comes out of the barrels, it is uh, carved and kegged and canned for your tasting pleasure. Hope you enjoy it as much as the brew team does here. This is one of our favorites. We love the complexity and the smoothness of this beer, uh, really showcasing some beautiful malt from an old school malting facility here uh, in the United States, Breeze Malting. So cheers everyone. Hope you enjoy this beer as much as we do.